it is my baby project thing that I've been working on for the longest time, and I'm mm -hmm. so proud of it. Um, I'm executive producer. I wrote up to five tracks on it. Um, I have been involved with the whole process more than I've ever been involved with one of my records before, so it's like a story I'm telling in this album. So when you get it, just so you know what to expect, every song is a different genre. We have rock, alternative, really? hip-hop, R&B, because in my yeah. CD case, I listen to everything from Bjork, Alanis Morissette, to um, D12, Jay-Z, Beyonce, Shaka Khan, um, Stevie Wonder. And I'm always the type of person who gets a CD who likes to... You know, like, listen to all the songs, <laughs> yeah. but lately, you know, I've been like skipping stuff because it all sounds the same. I don't know where one song ends oh, and yeah, one no begins. Kidding. You yeah, know what I, I'm saying? I agree with that. Yes. So this album, every single song, it starts. One starts off with a hard, you know, rock guitar. The next one starts off with some chimes. The next one starts off with, you know. Uh, acoustic. It's it's a really um, diverse album. So every person who you know, if you're a punk or if you're an alternative person or if you're a hip hop person, you'll enjoy the album. Yeah, oh my goodness, about? I'm so excited. Is it, will this be your first ride? No, yeah. um, I already have a truck right okay. now, and um, I, I have the truck. And I actually, when I was younger, um, my two dream cars, which they still are, I have no clue why, but um, a Jeep. You yeah, know, just a, a wrangler. Machine, a yeah. wrangler. Right, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. And then a red Lamborghini candy apple red with gold rims oh, well, and a gold candy. Oh, well, there you go. Oh, yeah. Um, but that yes. was when I was three, so I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're so raven now. At least you can afford it. Get the <laughs> jeans, girl. Go for the other one. All right. right um, exactly. Um, the car that I'm getting now is actually the new, um, it's, it's a Lotus, actually. Ooh. But it's, but it's not as, you know, it's not the, you know, the up there, um, uh, Lamborghini Lotus. Why it's do down I think there. you have like a lead foot? You're probably like hell on wheels. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, you know what? Yeah, no, I have to tell wheels, you. Yes. I have to tell you. I've uh, never gotten a speeding ticket. I've never no, gotten a violation. Knock on wood. Knock on wood. Wait, what do you break out with your Lotus, Lotus girl? Something. Oh no, marble. but my truck yeah. goes faster than the Lotus. How in the world? How did you do that? How did you pull it off? Because you were such an amazing actor. Um, not that you're not now, but you were such an amazing actor in that in that time period and it was like how in the world did you memorize all these so lines? Young. How, yeah how did you how were you so adorable 24 7 <laughs> is what and did you know that that's how people felt about you i didn't know the adorable part i was just i don't know about that part <laughs> I mean, it but, was really um, amazing to watch you act. Thank you, thank Cosby you. Show. Went to learn a lines even till to even today. Well, actually, today it changed a little bit because I can read. But um, <laughs> that helps. <laughs> it does. It does help. Um, when I was younger, my parents we used to go to the read through every uh, Monday, I think. Oh, say Monday. We used to go to the read through, and then um, at night when I'd go home, my father or my mother, um, whoever was you know wanted to do it that night, we would sit in the bed and read the script together. And that's how I learned how to read, too. Re and that's how I learned how to read. Um, but I would just know where my line stood on the page. And on the tape day, it's just like repetitiveness. Because mm -hmm. the next morning I would know it, just for some reason. But today, actually, I don't know how it transformed, but... I never read the script at night because I like to go to sleep and not have to worry about work. <laughs> mm -hmm. But yeah, really. I, I just see the script when I'm learning the choreography, which is the staging. And... When I'm saying my lines with the person, I'm reading the script from my head. It's so weird. Because somebody Train. was like, you wanna, you wanna, um, do you want to you know, run lines with me? And I'm like, well, I need the script. But you're supposed to memorize it. I said, yeah, but I'm memorizing how the page looks so I know where my line comes. It's, it's kind of weird. Alice lives in a land that I am envious of. Yellow dragons, violet cats, and black talking purple gnomes. She steps on anything that might get in her way of home. You, Alice had love, but she pushed all of her people away. She felt as if she was alone, distant, ugly, afraid. She didn't know that her life was already made. You're loved and you will find someone with your frame of mind. So if you would be so kind to not cross that line. And fall into a world where everything is flipped And where you fly to swim and you fly to drive 
Fly with me in the sea, swim with me in the breeze, drive with me on the clouds, fly with me on the ground, follow me into my rabbit hole, and I'll show you everything I've been told. I'll lead you to a land unknown where happiness is grown. That was, I, I've been in two cities for two weeks. So excuse me. Okay. Yeah, that was awesome. That was awesome. Nice. That was awesome. I'm actually very cheap. <laughs> yeah, my mom would be like, you said cheap. I am very frugal with my money. Uh, we were just talking about that. There's only certain things I will splurge on. And um, I, I totally believe in saving and because and this business is so fickle. You never know if you're going to be, you know, who you are. Tomorrow. That's what, true. what do you want to splurge That's on? True. I mean, when you, but you know. The only time I splurge is with shoes. Oh, okay. <laughs> that makes sure. sense. But even with my car, I was like, I'll get a bug. And my dad was like, Are you serious? Go get this. And I was like, but that's so much. He was like, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> since you were three, buy yourself a present. I was where's, like, okay. Because but where's your Jacob the Jeweler watch? That's too much. I wouldn't splurge on that because yeah, I, I know that I will lose the watch. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to say Jacob the Jeweler three times and you get one. I, oh, Jacob, yes, Jacob, 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 Jacob the Jeweler, Jacob the Jeweler, Jacob the Jeweler. I'm going to say it twice, you get two. It's okay. <laughs> I'm already registered to vote, and um, I, I I do believe in that. I am always, you know. That's going here because it's important that 18 year olds. I love is. that you're 18 and you're like telling people to, to to get behind that. Yeah, I for a while when I was you know right, like 16, 17, I was like, oh man, I gotta register, <laughs> and it's gonna be so difficult, and I don't know anything about it. Yeah. And then it's funny, like something clicked in my head, like. I have to register to vote. I am so excited. I get to make a difference. You know what I'm saying? I'm living in this country that I didn't get to have any say in for the longest time, and finally I can be heard. Perfect. So um, I can change something, and that's why I awesome. think it's important to vote. I have had pressure. People are like, you know what? We don't want you to do the movie because, you know, you need to lose this much. And I said, but that's not me, okay? I, my, I'm not supposed to be, you know, a size negative seven like most of the people here. Mm -hmm. And I am thick. This is the word that I'm getting out. We are thick and beautiful. What did I tell you, Drex? Yes, you know, like, I have a, delicious chubbies. I'm like, oh, no, shit, no, you're... No, <laughs> you know no. what else? I have a clothing say. line coming out that is made for people like me. And I think it's so important to, for people to know that half the people that are on the magazines or on television are not that size anyway. There are ways to stretch the screen, to, they're like on television. I've had that done to me, and I'm like, wait a second. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you mean before they put it on, on the air? Before they put it on the air, there's a way oh, okay. to stretch yeah. the film so that you look that. smaller. Yeah, yeah. I've heard stars, you know, they take pictures, even for the show, if it's for a gag, and they're airbrushing themselves because for some reason it's it's prettier to be skinnier. I don't understand. I know that my mom has a booty. She got some waist. She got a, you know what, tummy, motor love.